I'm Sir Tap Tap, and let's play Monument Valley Forgotten Shores. I've mentioned this previously in, in the series, but it just drives me up the wall. That this so Monument Valley originally cost I think like five bucks, six bucks, nothing. It cost nothing, um, and then and you know regular Monument Valley it's eight chapters, right? Ten chapters. Um, so then eight new chapters in this little DLC were two bucks. People flipped out! They got so much hate mail and they just... People are nuts. It's why, it's why we can't have nice things on mobile. Oop. And, um... That's a real shame. In fact, I recently... Pretty much just this past couple weeks, I deleted almost everything off my phone. All the free-to-play stuff. Because I was like, alright. This stuff doesn't cost you that much money, but it costs you a lot of time. And it's like, you know what? <laughs> I'm mostly limited by my time. Oop. I'm really mostly limited by my time, so I, I would rather, you know... Especially when games cost like, you know, five bucks or something like this. I would really rather... I would really rather play something like this. Or, you know, spend that time writing, doing anything else other than just grinding, so... All of my phone... I feel... I feel cleansed. I've been doing a lot of stuff to kind of focus myself and just keep to one task at hand and really get more done because that's I've I have a bad habit of procrastinating of of um, doing too many things at once and just things that eat too much time like that. It's just not good for me. And thanks for watching. Uh, let's play Forgotten Shorts. This I guess is the end. Oh, totem! There he is! Help. Help, Totem. I'm burning. I'm dying, Totem. Friend, please. There we go. Look at him. Look at him go. Hopefully this video looks a little bit better. Oh, spicy Totem. Um... <coughs> excuse me. You might notice this video looks a little bit better. I hope. Uh, recording it directly from an Android emulator, which... Nox gives me a little bit of grief now and then. Um, I don't know what its deal is. Oh, you can see the... You don't need to see that cursor. Let's get that. Let's get right, rid of that. Um, but yeah, here we go. Yeah, Nox. I mostly like Nox. You can just log in with your Google account and you just... You know, it's an Android emulator. You just go to the Google Play Store and all of your... The games you own are there. Alright, here we go. That's... Uh, it's a little bit weird sometimes. Can you come over here, Totem? Oh. Oh, I see. Oh, and before I forget, I was going to do a little bit of shout-out. So, shout-outs to Katie Rose, who is my first member since um, I instituted the new YouTube membership so you can kind of pay to... Um, support people and um, basically get some rewards. It's basically Patreon, but for YouTube is, is really what it is. So you can get some Parker pictures, some pictures of my cat. You can get um, access to um, early videos. Um, oh, there we go. Wait, do I need you? Oh, yes, I do. Um, but yeah, I just, they, they changed it. So it used to be five bucks only, but they changed it so you can set your own tiers. And so now I have, um, I have a $1 tier, so just anybody, you know, if you can give a buck a month, you can help me out. And, um, I, I, I that's what I have on my Patreon. I, I really just like people to pay just, just what you can. I don't want to have it like, you know, oh, you gotta do, you know, it's just, people got different budgets and everything. So I, I prefer people to just pick their own price, really, which, uh, Patreon is a bit better at than YouTube, but, uh, I figure the one buck thing. Is a good start. Um, unfortunately, uh, it's not technically my first YouTube member. YouTube members, uh, it's really weird. Um, YouTube being weird, how, how unusual is that, right? Um, but no, YouTube um, did not track and does not currently track your past memberships. Um, and it doesn't even send you a notification. If you're not online when a member subs, it, they don't, it doesn't tell you. It's, it's YouTube, it's Twitch subs for YouTube, basically, is what it is, as well. Um, so yeah, sorry to the first person, um, 
Big thanks, but I, I don't remember the name, and I've, I've set something up on my side. So now we'll get an email when somebody is a membership. So I'll give a shout out, um, and I'll actually know who you are. It's, it's kind of a neat little setup. It's definitely in, you know, kind of an early access, I guess. Well, it's like early stages. Oh, we can just skip to the hard ones. We won't, though. We'll just go. So I'm thinking, I'm kind of thinking of going back to them classic days of YouTube, that 15 minute limit. Um, obviously I don't actually have a 15 minute limit, but I'm going to kind of split this off at 15. I just feel, oh right, I remember this. Oh. So I did play this one, I, I thought I did. Um, um, I don't remember the purpose of this. Oh, oh, no I do, no I do. Wait, no, no, wrong way. Yes. There we go, okay. Yeah, if you never played Forgotten Shores and you enjoy the original Mining Valley, I highly recommend it. Um, you're checking it out right now, obviously, but um, it's got some new mechanics. Uh, beautiful, as always. And I believe there's a little bit, there's some story beats in it. To be totally honest, like I said, it's been years since I played, and I don't fully remember everything. I don't know if I played Ida's Dream or not. That used to be called Ida's Red Dream. It was a kind of a charity thing, and they kind of they eventually re-released it without the. I guess they lost the branding, or I don't know. Intellectual properties complicated, and oh, oh dear. <laughs> um. Basically, it's just Ida's dream now. Where's that game? So I can get on this. Oh, I think I see how it works. I love those stars. More, more games need beautiful skies. Don't just have your skies be blue. Skies can be whatever color they freaking want to. It's a video game. Come on. Be a little creative. I mean, I am fine with hyper-realistic games sometimes. Like, I just finished um, Days Gone. Great game. Very... Everything's very realistic. It's a... You know, it's a... It's a gritty survival... Zombie kind of game. And it's a lot better than you might think based on that description. Um, but, uh... I had, a, I had a blast with it. And, uh... I'm just about getting the Platinum Trophy on it. Uh, I'll probably get that today, unless... Um, unless there's a single particularly sticky, like, annoying trophy. Parker, what are you doing? If you hear slamming this Parker, he, he knows how to open the cabinets in my kitchen. And he likes to just get in them just to be like, Yes, I can do this, human. Nothing you can do will stop me. He just... Just can things, I guess. He likes to do that, but he definitely does. Uh, it doesn't help me, but this does. I've been doing a lot of changes, actually. I've been trying to meditate. You know, I got a, I got this Headspace app that's supposed to remind you to meditate and crap. And I, um, I think the mistake I made is that I set the reminder to be like in the morning, and that that was a dumb idea. I should set it for like nighttime. somewhere where I can like walk along a curve to get to oh there we go <laughs> I'm glad Ida knows her way sometimes because sometimes it can be a little bit of a a little difficult to tell where you can go but just just tap and Ida will do her best to get there if she can I love the colors just ever uh, the the palette choices in this game in general are just beautiful oh I gotta get down on Suppose I can no. <laughs> it's Parker breaking my things as always. Can you get there now? No. Mm. No. No, that won't help. Okay. 
I can probably have to go on this way. And then... There we go. Okay, we got this. I've been trying to um, hopefully improve my sleep schedule. That part has not worked out super well, but hey, um, I didn't do, do bad the last few days. I think the whole, you know, oh, that, that's so cool. That's so cool. Um, the whole COVID-19 panic, I think, messed with me a bit. I, I'm not too worried for myself, but it's like, there's all this... It's like you gotta you're hearing about all of this bad news all the time and it's still it's still really stressful for you Even if I'm not really in a age group that's too risky. I'm uh, My state doesn't have a lot of cases and uh, Though unfortunately my work isn't really taking it very seriously, and that's kind of a little bit frustrating uh, We really could be working from home If we tried hard and believed in ourselves, but uh we figured it out for a couple of people, a couple of higher risk people. Um, we did get them set up, and like we have remote, we have you know we have this screen connect stuff that lets us just we can basically access our work PC if necessary. And uh, oh, GG! <laughs> I forgot about that one. Whee. Ow! My hat! Give me back my hat! I don't know. I love these colors. I love those, uh, I think they're called onion domes, the little cupcake things, the Russian cupcake domes. Love those things. Um, hmm. Okay, you can go up, but I need down. Can I not? But no, no need down. Hey, hey! He's got my hat! Give me my hat! You little butthead! Oh, how dare you. Alright, what was the thing here? Am I missing something? I see you down there. What am I not getting here? This? No, there's no slope. Oh, oh, oh! Okay, I didn't even see that. Oh. Weird, they're on like a... Like this has like one cycle and this has like two cycles. Okay. I need you... I'm sure that I played this, but I have completely forgot all of the puzzles, so I guess... There we go. For most intents and purposes, this is a blind playthrough. As, as you can see, though I don't think... Now what? Oh, here we go. Though I think Monument Valley, if you're gonna do a puzzle game blind, Monument Valley is really not too... Someone turn off that dang metronome. Uh -oh. Give me back my hat. Yeah, I gotta trap him. Yeah. Wait. How did this go again? Oh, I can probably trap him down here. Oh wait, oh no, 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 he's not gonna come down here. So I have to trap him on top. There we go. It's close to the right idea. I don't know why I update software sometimes. Like I always want things to be like up to date and like secure and all that stuff. So I almost always update immediately when I get a thing. Um, <laughs> but OBS updated and things have been weird. One of my scene collections, like, what you're seeing now is a scene, right? And I, I can put images on screen, and like I can be like, okay, let me show you this like you know intracital thing here, and like blah blah blah. Uh, it forgot all of those for one of, for my mobile setup, which is what you're seeing now, my my portrait mode setup rather. And um, I, I, oh, oh, I see. Um, yeah, 
it was it's really weird and it I was having trouble streaming I was trying to stream Animal Crossing and it, it was weird Parker it was weird can I crush myself no I can't that's a shame um hello go away hi Parker yes how do you do uh what's like crush him <laughs> he looks so silly with the hat and the beak hi Parker yes yes uh, what what was that noise Parker I want to like obliterate him I want to crush him into juice but I don't think I, I wouldn't get my hat if I did that's why violence is always is, is never the answer kids I think I gotta, I think I gotta trap him on the button. Got it. It's like, mystery music. The chords are going all over the place. Gravity is very forgiving to the people of this world, I've gotta say. If you, <laughs> if you've got balance issues, you wanna live here, cause... Nothing bad ever seems to happen no matter how far you fall. Yeah, my audio was messed up in OBS too. I didn't... I don't know what happened to it, but I'll have to mess with it. Hopefully this video is fine. I'm, I'm not within the red zone. I'm not within the clipping zone of audio, so I should be okay. What it... Oh... shouldn't be I should be able to salvage it worst case but my audio is like way quieter for my voice and my um, the game audio is a bit loud but easy enough to adjust in post but just why I, I spent all this oh no no let's go away so I think I need him on this button This was. This needs to just not connect to him, and then I can trap him on it. There we go. Perfect. I'll have my hat back soon. Oh no, there's more of them. It's hard to dislike the crows. They are adorable, even if they are huge pains in the butt. confused as to where we are story-wise, because like we, we saved the crow people. So I would think this must be prior to Monument Valley, right? But also, Totem arose and helped us, so is that a reference? Or is this the first time we met Totem? I'm sure most people don't play Monument Valley for the story, but I, 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 love, I love stories and like simple little things like this. Uh, I think they can be... Really good and interesting. Um, like, uh, I think I, yeah, I trapped him. Which I think I need to trap him actually. Yes. I'll get you next time, gadget. I yeah, just need to go up here. I love these like little automated machines that you can make with just simple, repetitive. Give me back my hat! I can't... But, but my hat! But my hat! <laughs> yeah, we can't, we can't do the whole thing with the sacred geometries unless we got the hat. It's a very powerful hat, you see. It's a very powerful dunce cap that contains our strength. Works out, but 
I know that we're going to obliterate him from existence sometime. Ah, oh, here we go. Okay, position him over the blower. Okay, <laughs> some of these are a little bit clumsy with the mouse, but uh, it'll it'll work. Yes, yes, it's mine now. Haha! <laughs> Alright. I didn't notice before, are we returning or am I taking the sacred geometries? No, I'm returning them. Huh. So I guess this is part of the original. Maybe this was before. Oh, we got a Chivo! Uncommon completed the thief. Oh, did you see that? <laughs> Nox is being a little bit weird. All right, so that was the first three chapters in Forgotten Shores. I will definitely be continuing this. I just kind of want to keep the videos down to around, you know, 10, 20 minutes, ideally around 15. Um, that just, it really helps me out to be able to, because then I can just, I can sit down, I can record about two hours worth of video, and then I got, you know, I got a week's worth of videos that I can edit, publish out, and I think just making big videos has been making things a lot more. That and streaming. Um, it's fun, but it ends up being a lot more inconsistent in terms of output. And I've always, I've always heard that like 15 minutes is like the magic YouTube thing anyway. Like a lot of times there will be like a big topic that everyone's talking about and there's not actually very much to say. But all of the big YouTubers like just stretch that into 15 minutes because you gotta get you gotta get that max engagement or something. I, I guess. Anyway, let me know what you think of Onion Valley in the comments. Um, let me know what you've been playing. I, um, especially if you've been playing something premium or genuinely free on mobile. I'm looking for mobile games that are not like, hey, play a hundred hours to unlock the the green color or like you know stuff like that. Um, I did really enjoy Azure Lane. Uh, as far as Gashapon games, I would say it was probably, as in terms of like really like free to play, but you know you have to do the gasha bond to like unlock people uh it was probably the least bad but that doesn't necessarily translate to being good you know least bad is it's all relative you know you can be the um the prettiest horse fly at the race it doesn't mean <laughs> it doesn't mean you're that pretty um but yeah i was just i was just playing it for the art at, at some point like it's just like oh a new character i want to i want to look at this new character okay i'm bored now <laughs> and it's like you know what I don't need to grind, like, an hour every day just to look at a new thing. I can just look at it up on the wiki. I, I, it doesn't, it's whatever. But that's why all the mobile stuff is off, well, not all the mobile stuff, but all the free-to-play stuff is off my phone. And that's why we're playing, well, it's not why we're playing this. We're playing this because it's a good game, but that kind of reminded me, hey, Monument Valley is an actually good game, so we'll check that out. Um, see you next video, everybody. All right, gamers, remember to like, subscribe, and smash that bell. Frog, what are you doing in my house? I, I, I would just get out.